Welcome to Baldur's Kitchen with Magic Scoots. I've got a game of Star Wars Galactic Battlegrounds expanded parts for you. Um, it's going to be a 2v3 where I'll be playing as Trade Fed. So let's give you some commentary as I play. Right, here we go. Okay, so let's get these guys onto carbon. Check out that nerf there. Uh, what we got? Three nerfs, four nerfs, that's alright. Just to scout around a bit. Um, let's build an animal nursery. Just to put those in. Uh, get you guys on to food. Uh, that's not enough, that's not enough. Get that out of the way. Not very much food there at all at the minute, but so. So, do basic training upgrade. Uh, get these guys back. Actually, let's just have them fishing for a minute, just to get off this hurdle of not having enough feed. Uh, so, I've got 35 carbon. It's fine because I'm trade fed, so I don't have to build. Prefabs. Okay, my scout's gone a little bit further out than I would have liked. So the important thing is to scout around the base initially, around your own base. So who's my ally? Um, Galactic Empire. Um, it's interesting because that's another Mexiv. I said that and I've just changed over to food. Alright. <coughs> so what I think I'd do is get these three guys off those berries because they won't last forever. Just try and pick up some of this hunt over here. The fishing won't last forever even for that matter. That's my scout too. Yeah, so really important just to clear the area around your base, see what's around you. <coughs> Sorry, I'm coughing. Let's just grab that carbon. Yeah, I said before, uh, my experience with, with nerfs is very often there'd be nerfs just, just around, really close around your base and you don't, if you don't scout properly, you don't discover them until uh, later on, um, which can be a bit frustrating because you think, gosh, why didn't I collect those at the beginning of the game? So I'm collecting lots of carbon here. Um, so I need to watch my food resources, they won't last forever. But uh, that's, that's a good hunting opportunity over there. It's um, getting a carbon processor. So there's berries there. <coughs> won't, won't last forever. So let's put these guys in there. Oh, actually, it wasn't 
attention to me. Bring them over that way. And to join the hunt. Okay, so that's my ally. So let's do a quick whiz around while everybody's T1 still. So I'm starting to run <coughs> out of hunting berries now. So now's probably a good time to, to a degree, change up into or to have farming included. Right, here we go. think what am I doing? around. Actually, just as I'm here, let's grab some of that carbon on the way back. Okay, troop centers now and cost 152. Yeah. 
So I'm just using the power droid as a shield, basically. Uh, if anybody's wondering, it's because um, power droids have got really tough dura armor. So if people are shooting, um, really struggle to damage a power droid. Um, it's not so for melee units, though. Right, there we go. Killed a skin, that's good. Right, let's check my ally out. Let's research the whole electron scene so I can see what my ally sees. No, I don't really want to lose my ally like really early in the game, so let's get another war center. Let's get a war center up so I can do upgrades. And, uh, get my factory. Is yet? Oh, is that a gap there? I think he's left a gap. Do you know what? I might even. That sounds really stupid. I'm going to try and plug his gap for him. Because otherwise, uh, he's going to keep people running through here. Um, right, so for the minute, let's keep the troops coming out. Uh, let's see if we get another power call. Sorry, not a power call. Right? You know what I mean? Flame Trooper, um, so one of my opponents is First Order. Uh, flame Troopers are they're quite a cool unit. They're, they're basically mounted, but they're not very fast. So I don't know what. Like they got a good upgrade later on, but I suspect. Let's get that scout. They're actually scouting with him. Yeah, I don't know. This it's still early days for um, for this, but what I think is that I suspect that the uh, flame troopers, first order flame troopers, might not have the uh, the mounty armor class, which means they don't get damaged um, by units that kind of counter counter mounties to the extent that mounty itself would. Um, well, I'm gonna build more power droids. You might be wondering why I'm doing that. I'm ready to T3. So, a war center. So, my allies kind of alright at the minute. So, uh, spaceport is my ally built spaceport. Right now, what I'm going to do 
is it's a chemical power droid. I'm gonna try and put up Jedi Temple because with so many opponents, there's a good chance that they're gonna have the kind of sieves that you would you would choose if you're gonna go around gobbling up um, holocrons. Uh, so I'm not an efficient sieve for Jedi, but better to have the holocrons than let your opponent get them. Right, turn all three, let's get that upgrade straight away. And let's get a couple of strike nets. So I'll wait for that upgrade to do complete before I start researching anything. some anti-air uh, Let's keep going with the strike max, they're very powerful against troopers. increases the amount of hit points they've got as well as uh, does a similar thing with power cores. Okay, wall center. Let's get that upgrade. Um, need to have a wall center. Right, how's my ally doing? Right, I think what I could really to tell my allies get these scout makes over because they're amazing against troopers. And then let's try and do the the proper upgrades as well. Um, give me some ones here. 
obviously Fortress is amazing. Um, so I'm pushing that way. Obviously I'm going to try and I would say um, push out towards my ally as well. to get the holocron, that is a pain. Okay. Right, let's try and get that holocron. It's really important to get at least one of the holocrons, because I'm just not sure that... Uh, on my, my ally. How's my ally doing? It's good. To my Jedi. Yes. Is this thing on with my... Uh, where's my Jedi now? He's supposed to be on his way to pick up my ally.
send out. Okay, well, no. See much in the way of aircraft at the moment. Oh, keep, keep coming out with those guys. Um, keep getting port upgrades. Now, if I've got spare ones, I might try and get this money. So 
August 8th, very important to get one of these uh, upgrades. Something where is it where I mean I can't be trying to keep my economy really good. What I'm going to do actually, I'm going to sell a shadow of the food and carbon because I want these upgrades. That upgrade, that upgrade, that upgrade. At the minute, and do the same just to, just to get the whole. Because that's the good one. 
agreement. Let's try and take that fortress out. They've got fortress on me actually, so troop sensor. Take out that cannon. Take out that fortress. Do some some here with them. Okay. Yeah, so let's use the strike next to take out that first. Sure, where my waypoints are going to at the moment. So stick one over, one waypoint over there. Try and solid waypoints. Uh, these guys, you're all running out of carbon now, so you can move really cut from here. Uh, so, see what's going on there. Okay, there. So, maybe let's move these guys out. Try and get those guys in. So on T4, I've made some spaceports, there's not the option for the flying ones, I wonder if that's a bug. I think it probably is. Oh, it's been built there. Something else has 
scorpion, but it's going to be a fortress, and a pit fortress, so we'll take that out. I mean, you guys stop hit the buildings. Space these guys out because we're in uncharted territory with um, all the air cruisers around. Oh, let's get home in the same port. And as it's increasing the range of uh, my cannons, let's see if I had home in. Someone else is going on the way, like, because it's been a while since I've looked. I think they're doing alright. Yeah, they seem to be doing good, which is what you want. And now I'm in a nice position. Uh, what the heck? Alright, so yeah. I don't know if it's that one's waypoint or something similar. Let's get these guys to the front. Let's look. 
Let's take down the gate and take down everything. Keep the anti here. Can we get to the upgrades? Favor upgrades, really. machine.
I think across the map we'll begin to run a little bit lower on the resources now. So. Nice little spot there. My supply, I've been over 666 units, which is like a dream compared with what it used to be. Any um, old questions of the game? You did get to a point where it's possible actually to, to get all the holocrons by destroying your opponent's temples. So, I'll try and anticipate that a bit actually. Let's just get some Jedi. I'm not creating pad at once, not great, but let's go and try and get my opponent's resources. The strange thing about cannons is when they've destroyed the building you target, had them targeted, and then more often than not they tend to switch to just aiming at balls, which is frustrating. It's way better targets to be hitting.
stop. I'm going to use the workers now to try and destroy buildings. So, just get that programming. Just any, any spare workers I've got, I'm just going to bring it to the base. Because once you've got that programming, it can be quite good at tearing buildings down. So there's Jedi. Do you know what? There's the holocons to pick up, but it's so late in the game, I just might not bother. Unless I actually see my Jedi. Workers at this stage are probably better at doing that than uh, we even like make destroyers. Marcus. Did I 
guys all destroyed that target, seriously. But wait till you see that one, because it ends well. But you can sell one. There's only one opponent left, Ross Deco. There we go, game over. <laughs> 